Ignatius Freud 7 here, and welcome back to Oblivion. We're going uh, on the quest to kill the wraith thing that killed the guy, Sir, uh, what's his face? Sir Lathon, though, because I just knighted him, he decided that I wanted to come with me, and I was just running through, and I found this random cave, a uh, yellow tick cave on my way up to this one, and we were fighting conjurers and stuff, and Sir Lathon bit the, bit the bullet. He is dead, and there's no way to revive him. So he did have, however, this is why I'm not going to load because he had a Daedric bow, which I've been looking for, and is awesome, and a Daedric longsword, which I'll, I'm pretty pretty pumped about. Is that a, is that a, no, it's a dead end. Okay. In the second area of the Yellow Tick Caves, Sir Lathon was actually starting to get on my nerves anyway, because he kept, well, he had a torch. That was lit, and I just, I, I can't, it was throwing off my, my stealth, my stealth grooves, man. Um, I'm a solo, solo kind of guy. I knew him for like all of a few hours, so I'm not too tore up in the gut about it. But at the same time, it kind of sucks. I liked Sir Lathan. The brief time that I happened to know him. Is that where I came from? Yeah. Let's go this way. And there you are, Mr. Frost Ashrenach. Can we just like... Yeah, alright. Good. Booyah! What you got? Oh no. Oh no. Stop healing yourself. I've been burning through arrows too. Hello. Oh man, I can almost one shot the Mios with my iron, my shitty iron bow. Hi. No. Dang it. There we are. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, we stop that right now. You got a Daedric Axe. Oh, you it's a bound weapon, wasn't it? Dad gone it. Ga yeah. Diving ding 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 Is this the way back out? Okay. Cool. Check the chest. And out we go. Yellow tick cave. Sorry, Sir Lathan. It will be remembered. You should have just gone and waited for me at the right cave, but you didn't. And that cost you dearly. How do I get out of here? There's gotta be a way out. I don't wanna be in pictures. face <laughs> you'll you'll notice this about this game um, there are a few people that are classified as being essential because of that they can't die but in general everyone's fair game for death and as we progress through the storyline there are events that transpire that aren't actually different. Like, for example, Boris, the, the guard that is sort of the leader of the escorts for the Emperor. 
shows up later on in the game. And it's possible to keep him alive until until you get to the big nasty oblivion gate fight thing that I won't disclose too much of until we get there and then usually at that point you're already like super beast anyway and cold corn oh cool let me see if I can find some Shadow Banish wine. Oh, anyway. You're like... You're already so beast at that point. Can I get up there? Yeah. That you're pretty much only fighting Zivili, which is almost where I am now. And they just get wrecked. Like, every other... <laughs> every other person that's there fighting just ends up getting wrecked by the Zivili. So like you're 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 the sole survivor. Hey, no. Jesus, you has a shit ton of health. That's good. I'm fine with that because it helps me boost my marksman skill. Hey, and my light armor, and some other shit. Did it just fog over? Like randomly? I'm fine with that. Got no problem, no problem with that. No, you want to die? Shot him in the junk, and he did a little dance right there. That's kind of funny. Finally, jeez, we we're actually not going in the fort. Shadow banish wine. You can you, you can do this, guy. There we go. Alright. And can you make it up there? Is that a thing that you can do? Yes. Is there a chest here? For me. Ah, poop. I didn't see one up there, so I think we're good. No biggie. We'll explore the fort later. Assuming that we get around to it. I might do it off screen. Yeah. In this game, I want to say it's three in-game days for stuff to respawn in caves and such. You know, like new loot in chests. There's um, a couple of Amulets and rings that I'm looking for when I go through chat through uh, when I go through caves. Reflect damage is really difficult to find, and therefore, when you find really sweet loot that has it, you just gotta just gotta stick with it, you know. Imperial guard, yeah. Do 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 bur 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 bergamot. Yeah, that's it. Bergamot. Uh oh. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Alright. Well then, let's see. What shall we drink then? Restore no, I'm saving that for when I really, really need it. We'll do that. And I need to find the next location so that I can then... Actually, this one's close. Find this cave and then go drop some shit off at the house. Glade Mist Cave. Wait, how close am I? Ow. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. Get your ear. Had to deal with that. It's not bad. I can probably make that in this video. And then we'll proceed from there. I'll probably just go drop shit off at the house off screen. Because it's easier that way. 
I have five Daedric Daggers. Six total, but one of them is equipped. And what I'm kind of planning on doing is, is creating a, a Daedric Dagger for multiple different situations. I have one that has silence on it. I have one that does fire, ice, thunder, kind of sh kind of shit. It'd be pretty rad. My concern is the acquisition of souls. I have Umbra, which helps a lot. But it's not like in Skyrim where you can get that soul siphon thing where as you kill enemies you siphon some of their soul. So you kind of like recharge as you go. doesn't really exist in Oblivion. As far as I know, anyway. What's up, buddy? You have fun with that, Mr. Bear. Don't... Tidy your shit. Under Paul Cave, I believe... Is where we're supposed to be. Battling the foul wraith that now wields the sword of the Crusader. That's a bear. Really? Are you just like, are, are, are you super chill? Hey. Oh. That's the, that's what that is. The, the thing that I have active, which is, uh, Woodland Grace. It makes creatures not aggressive toward me. How freaking cool is that? It's cool. I was wondering why I wasn't being attacked by the bear. That doesn't bode well. Generally, that fog means that there's undead. If you see that white fog, white misty type fog? Yeah, undead. Oh, shoot. Yep. And with that, that sucks. Wait. Hey, all right. That's fine. I cannot finish. I can't. I, I can't do this cave right now. I have to go because I am over encumbered already, basically. And I need to go unload some of this crap. Some of this crap. So I do have time to do it on screen. So yeah, kind of show you my organizational system. Which, to be fair, is pretty lax right now because I don't have a lot. Of stuff. I'm still building up my alchemical collection. Eventually, I'll do like I did on Skyrim, and like you do on in Elder Scrolls games when you're trying to create or build your alchemy skill. Just go from city to city, buying all of the alchemical components that you can get your hands on, whoever is selling it. I know that th one of the best places to go is the alchemical shop in Skingrad, who, by the way, has some interesting flavor text. She's a dark elf from Morrowind, and she has some interesting questions. Faux show. I don't want to be in pictures. I gotta drop this off. Oh, I probably could have gotten that. Dang it. That amazes me. I've been playing this game for, well, recently for quite a few hours, but 
In the past, I used to play it a lot, like a lot. And I didn't know until this playthrough that you can just hold up or down and tap the R2. You can cycle through a lot faster. Food for thought. Oh, get over of all of this crap. There we go. Good. Oh, wait. Expert Olympic. Is that what I... Yeah. It would be. Skill. Uh... Do I have... Do I have a spot for books? I don't know that I do. Mm. That's good. It's all my stolen goods are right there. And then we have our treasure. I have one of the alien statues. Oh yeah, I forgot. I had arrows stored up. Mmm. No. For now, we'll put that away. Rusty iron. And would you look at that? We are out of time. I will continue this, or finish this, rather, uh, off screen. And then we'll come back in the cave that we just left from. So, as always, please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if there's something you want me to do or not do or whatever and we will you know it's all good bon tuna we'll see you next video